Hi there, for those of you who don't know me, my name is Katie Kaczynski. I am a freshman at the University of Iowa. I have just recently moved home due to the COVID-19 virus, but I spent the majority of my freshman year at Burge Residence Hall. Hi y'all, so today I'm going to be giving you a quick rundown over some things that I wish I would have known with my dorm and how it looks now. As you can see, there's plenty of room in our dorm. Um, I'm able to comfortably stand with both of my arms out and I still won't hit either of the beds. This is a triple, as I've said before, it's not a double, but in most cases the doubles are very similar in size and so you really shouldn't have to worry about too much for spacing. Definitely utilize your drawer space. I like having boxes of things so if I have like smaller items uh, for clothing I can put them in. Air and heat are going to be your best friends. Most dorms will have control in your room, some are central, but all dorms have AC. So this is the side of my room. Um, I really like it because it's full of pictures of people that I love and I'm a big picture person. At Iowa, each room is going to come with a desk which comes with three drawers, my bag's in front of the third, and then a dresser for each person as well as a bed. So let's start with the desk. There are three drawers, like I said, which are really helpful for storing things, but I also really wanted to have some height on my desk and be able to see the things that I use every day. So this is from Walmart and it was actually really helpful, pretty cheap, and it definitely gives me the elevation off of my desk that I need and want. I actually have these uh, square boards. This one's a chalkboard and this one is a dry erase board. I really like having my calendar out where I can see it so I can visually see what's coming up. Now my bed is probably like my favorite place in the entire room because it is so comfortable. Um, I actually have the mattress topper on underneath um, and that allows for like a very cushy bed which is really nice because sometimes dorm beds can get uncomfortable. And then I also have my tapestry that I got online. I'm in love with it. The lights are from Target and I really like them just to brighten up the room but I'm going to be honest with you we barely have them on so it's kind of up to you whether you really want them or not. This is actually a command hook. I really recommend getting command hooks in general. They are phenomenal for hanging things, whether you need to hang your headphones, belts, necklaces, etc. They are so helpful and they're safe for the wall so they'll let you use them. This is another must have for me. It's a bedside table and basically it hooks onto your bed. So whether you were up high, which is where my bed was originally, or down to like the normal level, it gives you somewhere to put your things. I like put my glasses and some like lotions. And it also has two USB cords, so this is where my phone charger goes and my headphone charger. It's really helpful because otherwise you don't have much space to put things. Now, like I said, you can decorate your walls however you like as long as you are using the proper adhesive. I just use tape, it's pretty easy. One of the things I wish I would have known going into this is that there are not that many outlets, so buying power strips is the biggest and best move you could ever make. I cannot begin to explain how important power strips are. They're so helpful to make sure you have enough outlets for all of your electronics. I know I said it already, but power strips, so important. My roommate has them too, we both love them. So this is our futon. It's actually really nice to be able to sit and study on. It can also pull out into a bed, which is what we really like. It fits perfectly between our two beds and right underneath our windows. So that is where we keep it. It used to be underneath my bed and my bed was lofted. But I really like that my bed's lower now because I can just hop on and I can sit up straight and study and do my homework more comfortably. Now into the not so pretty side of the room. Basically we do have a fridge and a microwave and a mini Keurig which is actually super nice. Uh, my roommate drinks a lot of coffee so she gets a lot of use out of that. I don't as much but I still do enjoy having the Keurig here. The microwave is super helpful if you want to make oatmeal or just some quick meals. And the fridge obviously is super nice. We have like a little freezer in there so we can have ice cubes. So if you do have a newer renovated room, you'll have a different type of sink and different lighting so it might be different. So as I've shown you before, you have a mirror with the bathroom and it opens up to a medicine cabinet. You also have a little cabinet underneath the sink for storage space, which is really nice. Because we have the extra desk, we also have more storage space under here. I have a little caddy for extra like medicines and stuff. I really like having it, but it's totally not necessary if you don't need it. Now I'll briefly show you our closet. There are two spaces up on top um, that you can put shoes, baskets. I really like having baskets. It's a cleaner look. And then I put my mirror up there just because we had it on the ground and we knocked it over and broke it all over the place. So we like having this one up and secure. Um, plenty of room for clothes. I only use like half of my closet for hanging space and then my one dresser which is really nice. If you're in a newer dorm, your dorm will have curtains in front of the um, wardrobe so it hides where your clothes are and you also will have uh, hardwood floors versus the carpeting 
which is why we got our rug. We really prefer to have like the softer carpet feel so we can lay down on it and um, feel more comfortable than just the basic flooring that they gave us. Totally optional, up to you. Um, you have two towel racks, which is really nice, so each of you have your own. And then I put up more command hooks. I keep like pepper spray, umbrellas, hoodies. And then I also put a hook on my door, which is like magnetic. That's where I put my winter coat so it's out of the way and not falling on anything. Honestly, there's a lot of different things you can do with lighting, pictures, and decorations throughout your room. So this is now my living situation. Um, there's some blank boards because I just don't have that much stuff anymore. But this is my room. I got to redo it a little bit when I got back from college. So I have like my dorm stuff up now and have the same like comforter because it made me really happy. But yeah. I hope this helps. If you have any questions about anything, I'm going to be making a video next week that answers questions that I've been sent throughout the year. I know that this isn't a circumstance that we wanted to be in uh, with the ending of school years. However, I think we can try to make the best of it and hopefully I'm able to answer as many questions as possible or I can try to direct you to people that will have answers to your questions. Um, I want to be a resource for you guys, so if you do have any questions, my Instagram and Snapchat are always open. You can always send them my way, and I'll do my best to answer questions for you. Um, hopefully this helps. As always, thank you for watching, and hopefully you can stay safe and healthy during this time. Best wishes.